Hey, it's Danny from Conscious Calisthenics here. So am I on juice or am I full natty? That is the question that I'm gonna answer today in this video. And I had it about two to three months ago. Someone that has a channel called Durian Riding goes by the name of Durian Riding. He's very well known in the vegan movement. Saw me in a shopping mall back in Chiang Mai, Thailand where I was living before I moved to Koh Phangan, Thailand where I'm living now. And he came up to me and said, you're on steroids. I said, no, I'm not. He's like, you're on steroids. I was like, no, I'm not. You're on steroids. And he knows who I am. I'm not like really good friends with him, but we know each other through the vegan movement, known about him from years. He's the one that got me into raw veganism when I used to eat a raw vegan diet. And so I'm very grateful that I discovered him at that time and learned some really good things from him. But yeah, it's just a funny interaction. He's just saying, yes, you are. No, you're not. Yes, you are. No, you're not. And then I just left it. I was like, I don't care what he says. And then he started speaking to me like, I should teach people how to take steroids in a very safe manner. Because there's a lot of people that promote steroids out there that don't really teach people how to do them in the most safe way for them. So yeah, am I full natty or am I on the juice? I am not on juice whatsoever. If I was taking steroids, I would be a lot bigger than I am. But what I say is you can be small and still be on steroids. For example, a lot of professional cyclists are known to take steroids and look how slim they are. So it depends on the food you're eating, the type of training you're doing, and so many other factors as well. They're determining the body type that you're gonna get whilst you're on steroids. And yeah, what I will say is I have done so much research into steroids and also testosterone because I have been very highly interested in the last few months to do an experimentation with them to show you what you can achieve naturally and what you can achieve with steroids. Because there's so many people that do these transformation videos on YouTube and in a short period of time, they go from having a really high body fat percentage with hardly any muscular development at all. And then all of a sudden, in this very short period of time, they have a super low body fat and really big defined muscles. And yes, you can grow muscles quite quickly without steroids or testosterone injections, but I'm telling you, the majority of people out there that do transformation videos, especially in the bodybuilding movement on YouTube, time and time again, are lying. And a lot of people have these expectations to get a body like them, and they get told by them that they're doing naturally when in fact they're not. And then people wonder why they're not getting the results that they did, and in the period of time that they did as well. So yeah, I have done loads and loads of research into this and there's so many different types of steroids out there. Certain ones are more dangerous than other. Deca and Tren are ones that can give you the most anger and frustration and rage and a lot of other negative effects as well. Some are stronger than others. So yeah, if I would take them in the future to do this experimentation, I would not be taking them at all. All. And you really need to be very, very careful because a lot of them can increase DHT and then you will start to lose hair and it also can make estrogen levels go up. So that's why a lot of them use aromatized inhibitors to actually stop the estrogen levels going too high. And yeah, normally the oral forms are more dangerous than the injection forms. But yeah, all steroids come with negative unwanted side effects, some more than others. So if you are going to take them, make sure you research as much as you possibly can on this subject to do it in the safest way possible. I'm not promoting them at all in this video. If you take them, if you do, then just be very, very careful. And if I do go to embark on this journey in the future, you will be the first to know. But for now, I'll stay to being full natty. And yeah, a lot of people think that I have taken steroids because I gained over 10 kilos of muscle in under six months. But with eating correctly and me doing intermittent fasting every single day, going to bed early, taking specific supplements such as vitamins and minerals and amino acids, and training correctly on a consistent basis, really, really hard and intense and many other factors, yes, you can gain a lot of muscle in a short period of time and lower your body fat percentage. But yeah, it is a lot of hard, consistent work over time, but if you want it as bad as you want to breathe, like I do, with my body, my fitness levels, and my energy levels, then you need to go all out. No excuses. Just keep pushing through that pain, keep moving forward, keep striving forward, and you will get the results over time. Remember the body you have now, you didn't just get this body overnight, and you won't get a body similar to mine or whatever type of body you're trying to achieve with losing weight and increasing muscle mass overnight either. 
So yeah, just remember that things take time. Be patient, be consistent, and you will get there in the end. But yeah, if I was gonna be taking steroids, I would be making sure that I'm changing up my training, adding a lot more bodybuilding, and just try and maximize the muscle growth as much as possible. And things like Deca and Tren, you can gain around 25 to 35 pounds of muscle within around six weeks when you're taking it correctly on a regular basis, doing all the other factors alongside. So yeah, that is a tremendous amount of weight increase in such a short period of time. And a lot of people come to Thailand specifically because it's one of the steroid vacation countries in the world because you can easily get most steroids straight over the counter at a pharmacy without any prescription whatsoever and it's cheap here to stay in Thailand so you can come here have a steroid vacation get your steroids really cheaply have a nice time here enjoy the weather enjoy the lovely Thai life as well so yeah that's why so many people come here time and time again and yeah they're one of the places where they are the cheapest as well. So yeah, that's it for this video. If you have any questions, leave them down below as always and get back to you as soon as possible. If you like the video, like it down below, give us a thumbs up and please share this video with anyone that you think wants to hear about anything that I've shared with you today in relation to me being on juice or full natty and some information on steroids in general. And if you haven't already, click that subscribe button down below to receive a lot more calisthenics workout videos for me on a regular basis, one meal a day videos, videos about my life, vlogging videos, what I eat in a day videos, what I do in a day, and many other videos that will help you go in the direction of inspiring you, motivating, helping you also go in the direction of achieving that the body that you desire, the fitness levels and energy levels. So if those type of videos sound good, you make sure that you click that subscribe button down below and you click the bell notification button. Otherwise, YouTube will not notify you of when new videos are uploaded and I have new ones coming every single week. So as always, stay fit, stay energetic, and go and get those gains. Peace.